Good, good plan. Okay. Well, I just want to say thank you to everyone. Um, sorry, I'm trying to get my words together. <laughs> um, thank you to everyone for being here today, um, for celebrating this momentous occasion. Um, for Olivia and I, I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm, I, I, I wasn't trying to be this emotional. I knew I would be, but. It is an emotional moment for anyone, and um, you can't help but feel it, and it, you just have to embrace it. Take your time and just live in the moment. Thank you, sir. It has been extremely hard. And Olivia and I have talked about how I'm not replacing my daughter. I'm not trying to become a new mom for her. I'm just continuing on the parenting and having this honor, honor and humbly accepting this privilege to be able to be a parent and to be recognized legally as her parent to be able to continue to guide and direct her. And as you can see, She's the one that's directing yes. us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see that. <laughs> so to be able to continue to grow and for us to both learn with one another and always just being that support to her that she needs. And um, I, I just want to be able to thank everyone that has come out today because we don't get this opportunity in the black and brown community to have this platform to be showcased in such a positive light. Amen. And when we have overcome so many obstacles such as my family and Olivia and I have, and for the media to still see us as a human interest story, I don't want to sit there and not acknowledge the thank you and acknowledge you all for that because it is truly a humbling honor that you still think of us as something to be desired and it it is truly it's truly mind-boggling and overwhelming sense of joy and appreciation to know that you guys really really wanted to do this and share this with us so not to be remiss from all that have come, Lieutenant Governor, Commissioner, Mrs. Tommy, Mrs. Dahlia, my family and friends. Um, thank you all, because without you, without this village, this moment right here could have been completely different. And I just thank Jehovah God for this opportunity to be able to share it with all of you. So thank you, and thank you, Judge. Um, I know we've been in and out of court many a times before you, and so I thank you for always, every time that I have appeared before you, that you have treated me with the utmost respect within the confines of your ability as a judge, and I, I really, I appreciate that as well. So this whole process has been extremely traumatic, but it is a times like this where it makes all of those tragedies just a little bit more bearable. So thank you all. Oh, thank, thank you, you all. Thank you.